how great the ceiling fans in my shot. You know, I just got to be so tall, right? Hi. Holy glare, let's not wear those. Okay, pasa everybody, how you doing? That's great, that's wonderful, it's actually fantastic and I know I'm standing up, I haven't stood up in a video like this in close to a year, so this is a profile moment. Like, I can move. <laughs> but what I really wanna talk about, why do I even do YouTube, like I, I suck. But what I really wanna talk about are signs that your partner, your significant other, or your bae may bay over you. Maybe over, you didn't get, you didn't get it. I'll just walk. Okay. Now, a lot of us have the tendency to stick around when we're not wanted, and I don't like seeing that, you know, because we live in a world today where you can be replaced. Like that light bulb. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Okay, one sign that they may be over you. They completely become distant from you, on purpose, of course. Now, there could be a handful of reasons why they're so distant from you, but the majority of the time, they're just simply over you. Maybe there's someone else involved, or maybe the person at the drive-thru messed up their order, and they just came to a strange realization this was a bad metaphor, but you're picking up what I'm putting down. Hopefully, you're probably not. Why are you acting different from me? Like, what's wrong? Shh, I'm distant from you. I'm like 28 miles distant from you. Making my way downtown, walking fast, faces pass, and I'm homebound. If at any point in time they did. <sighs> Why am I a YouTuber? Duh. If at any point in time you ever feel distant, just ask them, why are you so distant from me? And if they can't give you a solid explanation as to why, then just leave them because you're ultimately gonna get hurt. You know, so just go get a new order at Mickey D's, a McFlurry, you straight. The next sign that they may be over you is if they start fights over absolutely anything, they may be over you. Now, people typically start these fights with you because you're no longer satisfying to them and they're too scared to break up with you. So instead, they want you to become the angry one and leave them. Hey, why is this big tree in my house? Because it looks good for decorations. You know what else would look good as a decoration? And what is that? You no longer in my house. Why are you always picking fights with me? That don't even make any sense. You're stupid. Oh my god, you're dumb. You're you're stupid. You're stupid. You're dumb. You're. I'm leaving. I'm taking the tree with me. And sign number three that they may be over you is they simply lose interest. Now this one I hear is all common sense. If you don't know when someone's losing interest in you, then why are you even? trying to pursue or with the person. They no longer care to make you feel better or they no longer care to compliment you or they no longer care just to care, just just to care, just to care. I mean, I guess it could kind of look something like this. Why don't you ever want to have a conversation with me anymore? I just don't want to have a conversation with you, all right? Because I have enough conversation. Really? Exactly, now leave me alone. I'll enjoy a conversation by myself. I can do so much better than you, you're so mean. You're such a little dick, you're just, ugh, ugh. These are chocolate brownies, by the way. If anything like that ever happens, just, just, just leave. Because there they are with their cake and they're gonna eat it too and there you are left hopeless, cakeless, treeless. So there you guys have a video about me telling you signs that they may be over you. And if you find any of these signs in your partner, in your bae, or your relationship, or your base ship, just leave. We all deserve a conversation, heart. So if you guys enjoyed this week's video, make sure you give me a big thumbs up because I always appreciate that. And thank you, thank you, thank you for the 20,000 plus subscribers. You guys continue to blow my mind. Thank you. And before you guys leave, make sure you check out the description box. Please just open it up and read it. I'm in a collaboration channel. We're called Better Than Wi-Fi. Go check out the collaboration channel. I post every single Wednesday over there. So check me out if you want to see more of me. I need everyone to go over there. Just check it out. Subscribe. Do it for me. Support me. Support the channel. And also, while you're in the description box, make sure you follow my social media like my Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat, emails all down there. All this stuff. If you want to talk to me, get in touch with me, just follow me, talk to me. And leave me a comment on this here video because I try to respond to all you guys' comments. I, I just... I love interacting with you guys. So that's all I have for you guys this week. So check me out on Better Than Wi-Fi on Wednesday and also come back next Monday to see me here. So that's all I got. I'm out to say like, what's up, baby? Let me grab one thing off. Taking this tree with me. Bye. What's up, dudes? We're gonna hit the waves at three o'clock. And then we're gonna go to Boardwalk and get the babes at six o'clock. Awesome. Yeah, man. Hey, why do we still have a house phone in my house? How about you just ET phone your way home out of here? Hello?